y'all so don't worry about what it looked like okay don't don't worry about it like. <laughs> so i really needed to take a break y'all from this real estate course seriously oh my gosh like i read one more thing about title searches anyway y'all what's going on how y'all doing today let's see what y'all need to know today? Take what resonates, leave what doesn't. The shoe doesn't fit, don't put it on. High honors. So maybe y'all going somewhere soon, or, or you're going to get some kind of recognition, or you're getting a promotion or something. An award, maybe? Some kind of trophy? Okay. Okay, marriage. Maybe you'd have found yourself a good thing. Yeah, main female. Maybe you'd have found you a, 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 a high honor woman. Okay. Some other. I'm hearing. The, I let you know that you're my good thing. Even if you make a mistake and do the wrong thing, I'll forgive you. I just believe that you and I are supposed to be together. Hold on and don't let go. Okay, so let me get some life is like a song on this because this is dope. Let's see. Life is like a song for my brewers. All right, I'm going to take these that fell out. We got so into you when I see you. We got catered to you and roll some more. Yes, indeed, honey. This person is feeling you. You're always on my mind when you come around and get shy when I see you. They're so into you. I really like what you've done to me. I can't really explain it. I'm so into you. Baby, let me cater to you because this is your day. Do anything for my man. You blow me away. We got roll some more. Stay up all night and lay up. Okay. Baby, roll some more. Okay, I like that. Let's get some cosmic insight on this. Let's see. Cosmic insight on this energy right here for my viewers. What's going on? What is the message? So you got someone here who's wanting to marry you, honey. They, they feel like... The highest honor would be to marry you or maybe you feel like the highest honor from this person would be marriage okay let's see what's going on here yeah we have open up your heart i'm hearing two hearts become one so maybe you guys are getting married soon yeah it says find out more information don't overwork yourself okay you could be dealing with a water sign pisces cancer or scorpio person What else going on here? My viewers. What else did they need to know with the cosmic insight? Yeah, so you guys have could have been dating for a while, okay? Maybe you guys are going to be dating. Maybe this person could propose um, while you guys are at a date, okay, at your favorite restaurant. All right? Um, maybe somewhere that you guys went for Valentine's Day. We have Earth sign here, so you could be dealing with a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn as well, or that could be you. So we have water sign and earth sign here. Okay. What else? Yeah, so something is going on with the heart. It's, I feel like you just need to open up your heart. I feel like some of you... Yeah, maybe some of you have been closed off to love, but your intuition is telling you something about this person here. So you could be the one being guided towards this person, or this person could be guided towards you, okay? But there's a bit of a mess here going on, okay? You also could be dealing with an air sign as well. But something that you are, are manifesting is here, okay? I see things moving forward. Things are changing. Mm, you're trying to figure it out. You're trying to figure out what you want. Something to do with your pet is significant. Okay, so you could have a baby or you could have a pet baby. You could be a pet mom or you could. You guys could actually 
be careful if you don't want to get pregnant because we got pregnancy here and then we got vacation okay so some of you could get pregnant on a vacation this person could live at a distance from you as well so maybe y'all could have some, some some makeup sex and um you know get you guys get pregnant if that's what you want it says marriage here okay that comes with family and stuff okay so let's see what else is going on here let's get some lovers oracle because y'all over here in love and marriage and here comes the baby in the baby carriage this <laughs> type of energy so look at her wedding rings before i even do anything we got wedding rings so somebody's definitely getting married y'all invite me now to the wedding now let's see what y'all got going on for my viewers love love unconditional love too what's going on with this love so many things i've got to tell you yeah we got talking here they want to tell you they want to tell you how they feel but i'm afraid i don't know how look y'all have insane chemistry y'all really y'all have mutual um feelings for each other this is beautiful here look y'all mirror each other that's what y'all do y'all have mutual feelings for each other that's beautiful that's why this person want to marry you this person like yep this the one so they could have had some kind of epiphany here with this lightning card or something could have changed what happened with the lightning card what happened something about their um something about their growth could have changed their stability could have changed so they could have had a uh, a new job or something what happened what's the lightning card what happened What's the lightning? This person likes you though. They they could have been watching you. So maybe this person could have could have felt like they didn't have enough to give you. Okay. They maybe they feel like they weren't making enough or something. I don't know. But I feel like this person, something happened and now they definitely are coming to shoot their shot to take you on a date here. We got Cupid's arrow and date. So somebody's definitely wanting to talk and meet up. Maybe a little coffee date or something. I don't know. But this person, whoever this is, they want to come to you and they want to say something. They sure do. Let's see. What else? Hmm. So someone here is missing you. So this could be someone that you cut off from the past here. Someone hmm, that you separated yourself from. If this isn't this person, okay? Like I said, y'all could be at a distance. And that could be physically or emotionally, okay? But something, uh, whatever is going on here, this relationship is, is ascending. It's evolving, okay? It's going uh further to the top all right y'all y'all going places i don't know this person might take you in a hot air balloon honey y'all gonna do all kind of like fun stuff together like this person this relationship is like healing the inner child in you in you guys you guys are soulmates look at that you're soulmates okay this is your person that's why this person is going to marry me meet me at the altar in your white dress yeah so someone this could be someone from your past that's looking at you missing you looking at your photos and stuff okay yeah they're playing things over in their head thinking about you know uh how things could have went this could be even someone that you work with too or just someone from your past trying to come in yeah this is definitely someone from your past that hurts you okay they could be watching you thinking about you missing you sending you kind of energy you know trying to get you to think about them or something anything else from this don't pray about them honey because you got your divine masculine or divine feminine here i wouldn't even worry about them at all okay don't worry about them at all anything else from this day look at that we got engagement ring i'm telling you this person wants to spend their life with you they they want to offer you something okay they you make this person feel the way that they have never felt before y'all maybe want to go get my um come on come on with me and get the messages from the heart deck Is. this person you you make this person feel you know brand new you make this person feel like a way like i said a way that they've never felt before so let's see what what they want to what if we can tap into their energy really quick okay holy spirit what messages could this person want to say to our viewer hmm. this is how you know this person things are going well because i think we're moving too fast that usually happens when things are going well like whoa this is going too fast this is things are going good right yeah they get scared 
So you definitely are making this person feel, you know, really good about themselves. They get nervous, okay? You got that when I see you, okay? They, they, you, they, if they say that to you, don't even, it's not personal. This person is just hasn't experienced that kind of love before, okay? So let's see. But this person definitely wants to be in a relationship with you. They definitely do, okay? So somebody, let me not take those. Let her, don't take those. So what, what is this their person wanting to say? How are they feeling? How are they feeling? What are the messages from the heart, from our part, positive energy viewers? We have just laid on me. Okay. We have I'm too afraid to love again. I knew it. Like this person is afraid. They, they, they wouldn't know real love if they slapped them in the face. Oh, until it slapped them in the face or whatever. You know what I mean. If it was standing in their face. Whatever. Whatever. It's in your face. On your face. What's the messages? It says, you can trust me with your heart. That's what this person wants you to know, okay? Because this could be you, you know, really guarded and everything, you know? Let's see. What do we have here? Put a ring on it. Yeah, baby. They definitely going to put a ring on it, honey. They definitely going to put a ring on it. I told you. This person definitely sees you as marriage material. What else? Going on here for my views. This person loves you. Love. They love you. I love you. What can I do to make you see? You're the only one for me. They love your laugh. They do. Look, I was I swear when I when I heard seen I love your laugh, I heard do 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 and look, I love your smile came out. I love your smile. Come on, Holy Spirit, for the confirmation. So they love your laugh and your smile. They do. Y'all, I need to do my hair so bad. It's ridiculous. It's, it's, woo! Anyway, let's see. It says, your love is healing me. Didn't I say that? Didn't I say y'all love is healing the inner child in each other? Your love is healing me. This person, I'm telling y'all, says your eyes say it all. This person loves being in your face. They love looking at you. So you must be very beautiful, very attractive. Both of you are, I feel like. There's nothing like spending quality time with you. They enjoy spending time with you. Like This person could be with you for hours and hours and hours and hours because you are perfect for them. Wow. It says you are perfect for me. Wow, somebody is in love over here. This is beautiful. It says, can I trust you? And they like the way you think. Honey, they like the way you smile. They like the way you laugh. They like the way you think. They like all of that. They feel like you make life worth it. Who is this person that's wanting to put a ring on it? Then it's like, when I split the deck, come on, some, uh, do, don't we look good together? What? Who is this? Let's keep going. Messages from the heart from my viewers person. I miss the time we used to share. So some of you are dealing with a, a, a past person. But this could be a person that you're distant with. So maybe you guys, maybe this person works a lot or something. You don't get to spend a lot of time with them. But they enjoy spending time with you. They do. Like Y'all could probably talk all night long or something says i never meant to make you cry so yes yeah, some of you are definitely um dealing with someone uh from your past who you separated with too remember to take how it resonates okay if you would like to book a personal reading please message me okay or go to dishingoutpositiveenergy.com we have i'm sorry i hurt you yeah someone definitely um they hurt you look it says i'm over it so that could be you or them take how it resonates but that someone here definitely wants to have a family with you, okay? Look, <laughs> I got it, babe. Don't worry about it. They gonna help you with things. You are gonna have to do things by yourself. It says this is between you and me, no one else. So y'all gonna have like a sacred kind of union, you know? Ooh, look at this. Wait, let me show y'all what came out. It says you lost one. We are meant to be together forever. You mean the world to me. And never ended love story. So y'all have like 
And then they <laughs> gotta come, can I come over at the bottom? Y'all got like some kind of never ending love story. Like, what else from this person? Anything else? Okay. Oh, we got one. I'd give you the world if I could. This person definitely. <laughs> They definitely want to um, give you the world. They definitely want to give you something. They want to spend that. I feel like this person really wants to spend their life with you. Like, I feel like they would, too. Like, this person. This person adores you. Let's get some metaphysical oracle. This is wild. We ain't even do no tarot. <laughs> Let's see. Here's confirmation. Y'all could probably go back and, like, past lives and stuff you could probably go back to your akashic records and find information about how you guys were married together in the past life or something let's see what else what other messages for my viewers we got joy and light y'all gonna have a baby <laughs> whoever going on vacation y'all about to get pregnant so if you don't want to get pregnant y'all better wrap it up but somebody about to have a baby and if that's not you and you don't want kids then don't then don't let it apply, okay? Don't force it. But for somebody, somebody gonna give me. It's gonna be passionate. Y'all gonna have that good passionate sex. Honey. Because you guys are seeing things from. Look at the confirmation came back out. You guys are seeing things from a higher perspective, okay? You, you're starting to see things differently. Y'all know. You know, you're starting to, to understand the spiritual connection that you guys have with one another. Because you guys definitely are connected spiritually. There's some kind of connection here, all right? There's some kind of truth or something that you guys are creating. You guys are going to create a legacy together. What else? Yeah, you guys, this is a, this, this relationship is protected. Okay, this person is going to be your protector. All right, you can trust this person. Yeah, you're not going to have to do things by yourself anymore, okay? Somebody here is used to being by themselves, creating things on their own, doing things on their own. But this person is coming in to help you, to be your protector, to be your provider, okay? This person is going to love and care for you, okay? Take it how it resonates. Man, these cards is a mess. This, oh, this, gonna be, this person is going to surprise you. I feel like there's going to be a lot of things that's going to surprise you with this person. This person... Yeah, this person is going to give you all kind of gifts and stuff. Or maybe this is you. Let's see. What's this glam? I feel like this person does. Yeah, I feel like this person wants to spoil you. Whoever this is. Whoever this is. This person wants to spoil you. They might want to take you out on. Take you. Maybe that's their love language. Okay. Gifts or something like that. Quality time. For some of you, your person's uh, love language is quality time and gifts. They like to give to people and spend time with them. What else can we know from this metaphysical oracle deck from our viewers? They go, he would be like, put on your red dress, hey, and let your hair down. This is like, people going to love y'all. Y'all going to have that community hood kind of love. Like, people going to love to see y'all together and stuff like that. Like, like it's, yeah, this is going to be dope, y'all. Y'all gonna create some powerful things, you two. Y'all gonna be like a power couple. This person, y'all might even write little love letters to each other. Maybe y'all do that already. Y'all write little notes. Or maybe somebody here probably like in the morning that y'all live together, somebody write notes on the mirror or y'all leave little sticky notes for your man on the mirror or something like that. That is so cute. <laughs> that is so cute. We have alignment and nurture. Didn't I tell y'all like... You guys are definitely in alignment with this person. This person is, for the fellas, for the masculines, this this feminine is very nurturing to you. Like, you enjoy what she provides. You enjoy that nurturing energy that she provides to you. That's be These mosquitoes? That's beautiful. What else can we know? This is a relationship that you're going to want to nurture. You're going to want to do things for this person, and this person is going to want to do things for you. Mosquito, bye, bro. <laughs> yeah, it's going to be a balance, okay? It's going to be an equal give and take with each other. Because like I said, you guys are intertwined with each other. You guys are connected. Like, one person could be thinking about something and the other going to be thinking the same thing and say it out loud. This person is going to be peaceful. They're going to be bring peace and balance into your life. 
maybe y'all look at each other in the mirror or something. It's something about the mirror is significant. I don't know. Some of y'all freaky deaky people might have a mirror over your bed or something like that. I don't know. That's your business. <laughs> but um, ooh, we hold on. Wait. Something's messy. Let's see what else going on here with my viewers. What else do they need to know? Anything else from this day? Yeah, you guys, um, one of you had an ego death. One of you could have been into the other sex, or one of you were just figuring out your sexuality, you know, what you are, who you like, what turns you on, what doesn't turn you on, okay, something like that. Some of you, your religious beliefs could have held you back from this person as well. There could have been something that you, you know, had to leave behind. I'm, I'm not sure what that is. Only you would know, okay, but it's something that you may need to pay attention to as well i feel like some of you guys are also going through a spiritual awakening where you get initiated in the spirit okay you guys are having some kind you're getting some kind of clarity on something yeah on, on how to speak your truth or on how to open up it did talk about opening up your heart chakra here okay some of you are doing that as well spending time meditating maybe um yeah, you're letting go, doing some inner work, doing some inner healing, some shadow work so that you can receive this beautiful, magnificent love that is coming in for you. I don't know if I should go into the tarot or not. I'm going to just get some African goddess rising and then I'm going to let y'all go. Because I feel like we've been on here for a long time already. And I'm about to go inside because these bugs get on my nerves. So, let's see, what's going on? What is the message for my viewers? Yeah, I feel like all that you desire is coming in for you, okay? I feel like karma is on your side, like you're on the good side of karma here. Like things are coming into balance, coming into play for you, okay? Things are, are being brought to the surface that were underneath. You're bringing out those great things, okay? And standing on that. And then you have fearless love here, okay? You, I feel like you guys are going to be loving fearlessly this time. You got the number 25 twice, so you could be 25. But well, the number 25 could be significant to you guys. But I'm just getting like whatever you have been sowing, okay? I feel like your intuition is telling you that something's coming in for you, okay? Like... haven't been sleeping that night okay it's something that you may have needed to speak on okay but living your truth be in your truth okay speak your truth be who you are okay allow yourself to see the reflection your reflection okay but you got some good juju right here okay you about to be reaping some good rewards here okay things are coming into balance i'm seeing seven 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 here so maybe some of you go play the lottery do show scratch offs or whatever but i see the infinity sign here representing karma representing cycles closing out and new things okay we got live out loud and celestial alignment for y'all too as well so definitely something's coming in so forgive yourself for everything that you you've gone through because you're gonna be feeling safe with this person honey this person is going you make me comfortable with you my mouth is watering so this you y'all y'all really you really attracted to this person like you or this person drools y'all can talk a lot y'all just have a wet mouth i don't know but it's something like that child where i don't know maybe i just got some kind of mouth watering love <laughs> or something like that i don't know y'all but this is the message that i have for you i hope this helps i hope this works out for y'all um this is beautiful like this is a beautiful love i think i'm gonna title this i'd give you the world if i could but um remember to take what resonates i love y'all thank you all for your likes, share subscribes and comments okay until next time